Hello, I thought I'd do another video just quickly because uh, I haven't done one in a while and this place where I am in a one bed flat is uh, just getting so full of stock that I've made the decision to get myself some storage. So I'm moving everything out of my lounge and putting all of that into a uh, lock up, a garage, which is about five minutes uh, drive down the road, not that far. So this is how it looks at the moment. <coughs> it's pretty chocker. I've started clearing it already. I did have a uh, load of shelves in that area and so I've cleared some of it as you can see. Uh, some mannequin for... Yeah, stock is everywhere. Those shelves are full. Full. There was another set of shelves there. That's uh, already gone down to the unit. Uh, I've got another shelf full of, or shelves full of stuff. There's a sofa under there somewhere. Um, oh yeah, you can see a bit of it there. So, this, and this is the next set of shelves which is uh, to be moved next and clutter on that one too. So, I'm going to uh, clear all this and show you the result of uh, of clearing it and I'll show you the unit as well where I'm moving all the stuff to so hopefully hopefully by the end of it I'll have a decent space in which to live rather than living in a warehouse um, I'll get a bit of a, a home back and uh, yeah everything else will be in the storage unit so let's have a look and see how we get on Okay, so a little update. I've uh, done a little bit more since the, uh, the last video. So you can see, uh, I'll just turn the, uh, the camera around actually. So it's piling up uh, big time. That's the, uh, the lounge floor currently. Um, and then I've cleared this uh, set of shelves here. Um, now the last video, I think there were some shelves behind the sofa which uh, you can see a little bit more of. It's still holding a load of uh, stuff there. Um, I'm now going to empty this set of shelves and uh, take that down to the unit. And I found a bike behind the uh, the sofa. Um, access to that at last. So yeah, it's still in pretty shocking condition. But uh, yeah, hopefully um, next time um, well, I'm going to film a little bit more, but uh, that's where we're at at the moment. Chaos. Oh, so I've uh, managed to uh, move a few more things. If you see in the uh, here, I've actually come across here. I've moved the sofa from a bit over there back towards the wall, which gives me a bit more space because I had the uh, the shelving units behind it. I've still got all of this to, uh, to clear though. I'm not too sure where it's going to go. I've got this unit over there which uh, all of the stuff that's in the unit there is going to go into the garage unit and then somehow I've got to deal with this, the bike. Underneath that pile there's a sofa surprisingly um, and I've moved that bookcase and uh, the DVDs next to it to that new position uh, which came from over there. So already I can see that the room does have potentially a lot more space than uh, it did before but uh, I've got a bit of a way to go. So uh, and if we go through to this other room a minute uh, which is the bedroom I can show you that I've located some stuff which I thought was listed but isn't which is all piled up there, which I've got to relist, and in that pile there. So you can see the uh, the fun of living in a one bed flat. You've just got no space at all, but you can make it work as well. And now that I've got this uh, garage, then uh, I'm going to um, certainly have a bit more living space, which will be a hell of a lot better. And I'll show you above me, um, I do have a loft and in there is a whole load of stuff this but maybe i'll show you that another time right here we go i'm going to uh, work on the the lounge a bit more now and we'll see how we do 
Okay, so I've done a uh, little bit more since the last uh, video, just keep adding to this. So I'll show you what I've done. Um, there's still a way to go. Um, I can actually see that sofa now, it's just got a few bits left on it, but uh, it's taking shape. I'm putting packing materials down there, like all newspapers that I can use to pack the boxes and various rubbish. Uh, and then I've actually got a table from the kitchen, which I've managed to put underneath the window there, makes it uh, a bit more homely. I picked up those two share chairs on uh, FreeCycle recently. I've still got the, uh, the floor to clear though. Um, and I've put some other uh, bits on those uh, shelves there. And then uh, that sofa you can actually just about see now, although I still need to clear all of this uh, stuff uh, as well. So it's coming together, but I've now, by doing this, moved some stuff around and in what I'm using as, well, the only other room. The only other room in here is my bedroom, and uh, I've got that area free because I have got this pile from the uh, the lounge, which all needs to be listed, which wasn't listed, and that lot to be listed as well. Plus, it didn't help that I went to car boot today and picked up some big chairs and a uh, stereo to be listed. So. Um, yeah, there's a whole lot more that I need to deal with, but um, yeah, I'll show you the garage soon so you can see where it's all going, because uh, it does give me more space than I've been used to. Okay. Okay, so now I'm uh, at the garage, and if you look behind me, you can see all of the stuff from the, uh, the lounge is now inside. I found a place for the bike and uh, it's not taking up too much space which means I've got a lot more space to uh, get some more shelving units and uh, fill that side of the wall and possibly go down the middle as well. We'll see how it goes. But I've managed to get uh, all of this lot in. I've got a few more bits to, uh, to bring down but uh, that's alright. They'll uh, go in these spaces quite easily. And uh, and then we'll be uh, we'll be good to go. But uh, yeah, I've got a lot of extra space which I didn't really appreciate. I would have quite so much space by doing this. I've got space in the lounge to have a better quality of life, and I've got more space to get more stuff. So now I need to get down to some car boots. So let's just uh, take one final look at the lounge complete. Okay, so um, I think we can call this a work in progress, although for the amount of effort that I've uh, put into this uh, over this week, um, my lounge is so much better than it uh, has been in far too long. And I'm just happy that I've got a lot more space uh, to, to enjoy living in and not have tat everywhere in this room. Saying that, I still have got a lot of tat lying around but it's uh, nothing compared to it was and it's manageable and I'll be clearing that out as soon as I can. So this is how my lounge now looks. So I'll just, there we are. So I've still got uh, packing materials there. I've got the, uh, the sofa there and then I've got uh, a table with uh, various discs behind it on the uh, storage heater to uh, all be cleared but uh, this is just stuff that I'm going to work on. went to the car boot, got a stereo, doesn't work but uh, I'm going to have to chuck that I think and various other things. So I need to clear this table because behind there I want to use it as an actual table. It's got uh, stuff there that you would normally see on the table and that that you possibly wouldn't. Um, Obviously that area needs to be cleared, but I just stuffed stuff into that little space there just for now, just to keep it out of the way. I'm hoping for a couple of those items to sell, then that'll be gone to the area. And then, yeah, my stuff pretty much on there, apart from the bits that are on the floor, which uh, again, um, are going to have to be listed and go in those bits. 
and a few bits on the uh, that sofa there but you can actually see on see the sofa and actually sit on the sofa now uh, which you definitely couldn't before um, I might even put a picture or something up on that wall it's looking a bit blank I did do that on the other two walls I don't know if you notice so yeah it is a hell of a lot better uh, than it was and uh, yeah I'm really pleased with the results however I have given myself another project um, because the bedroom I have piled a few bits in in here now um, so I do have that space to to clear um, so that all needs to be uh, dealt with so that I can actually get to the curtains at the moment I just use a pole to uh, enable me to access those curtains to be able to draw them but you know there are uh, a few teething problems still to be solved um, I'm still drowning in stock but at least I've got a garage to take the stock down to now um, so am I pleased that I got that garage yes I am it can hold more stock um, it doesn't have to be quite in my face and um, I have a better clearer mind if that makes sense for having a tidier place and I know it's something that my mum always said um, a tidy place is a tidy mind um, yeah I do have to agree um, and that's painful to say I'm not a tidy person I never have been and I guess I never will be but I am organized I do I have to be organized I can live live in what looks like utter chaos to everybody else but to me I know where it is I'm organized tidy guilty no but there are moments where I do have a a uh, mad thing and do what I've just done in the lounge and completely tidy it and I just hope I can keep it that way um, yeah wish me luck and if you've enjoyed watching this uh, adventure then please subscribe to the channel and like it thanks very much see you in the next video